Now, as a Jaguar owner and passionate designer and architect, I was thrilled to be invited by Jaguar to learn more about what goes into creating their fantastic vehicles, which have always had design at the very heart of their appeal. Now, behind me is the fabulous Advanced Product Creation Centre, which houses Jaguar's engineering and design teams. Opened last year, it's the country's largest automotive creation and development centre and one of the UK's most sustainable non-domestic buildings. Up to 20% of its energy comes from almost 3,000 square metres of photovoltaic solar panels on the roof and the remainder from 100% renewable sources. The same glazing technology as the Eden project has been used to bring natural light into the building wherever possible and make it more energy efficient. So actually an incredible piece of engineering and architecture in itself. And I'm told the design studio inside is one of the most technologically advanced in the world. So let's go and take a look. So Adam, thanks for having me today. I feel honoured, actually. I've wanted to see this building in all of its glory. It's all very new still, isn't it? What's it like to work in? It's fantastic to work here, George. It's a brand new state-of-the-art studio. We think it's one of the best in the world. So we've got 30 of these clay modelling robots that uh, mill clay models like this. What we do, George, is we go from the first sketches, yeah. okay, then we go into digital software and create a three-dimensional form then we want to quickly evaluate that on a model. And it could be on a scale model or a full size model. And we mill that out quite quickly to get the volume and proportions as we call it. I'm amazed by the process between kind of high end technology, but also having hands on sculptors to yeah. create these amazing forms. It, it really is craftsmanship on every level, isn't it? It is absolutely, George. Yeah, and you know what? That is one of the nicest parts of the job working with this great team to produce models like this because they really are artists in a way. The other thing we've got to mention is the combination of aesthetics with engineering. I mean, under this, there's going to be an amazing battery, amazing performance, comfort, luxury, the lot, hasn't it? Yeah, I mean, you're totally right, George. That is the really difficult part of the job. It's getting that first sketch to a car out on the road, fully engineered and performing brilliantly like any Jaguar should, trying to make it still look like that first That's sketch it. that you yeah. did. Well, I've had my eye pace for nearly two years and I love it. I absolutely love it. It's a joy to drive and a fantastic bit of engineering. But let's jump on the next stage. Okay. So over here, you've got yourself a little mini, tiny model of an eye pace. Does that come after this stage? or before the one-to-one -one clay? Is this just a bit of fun? This, <laughs> it, it is a bit of fun, but, it, it, but it's serious as well, because this, this scale model comes before the full size. So imagine all the designers, all the design team have done all their sketches, yeah. and we've looked at them, and we've picked some out, and then we say, right, okay, we're gonna make four or five of these scale models, just to test out the themes. They're usually to the same overall proportions like the wheelbase is set and the length and everything and then we again from digital we'll build the themes from sketches in CAS as we call it computer aided surfacing and then we can mill these models with these massive robots you've got some black tape in your yeah, hand so what's what, this what, about? What so this is like sort of black masking tape as a designer you can play around with the lines and you can change things and you you can work on your theme so then we'll be working on this for sort of probably about a month. So you could play around with, with a different theme where you had one line just going through. And then what we do when we're happy, when we've analyzed it, we digitally scan the model and then we can work on it digitally as well, refine all the lines, mill it out again. So it sounds like it's constantly back and forth between aesthetics, engineering, the digital world, and being hands-on with the model. Okay, George, so this is Sham. She's Hi, one Sham. of our best clay sculptors. I just wanted to talk a little bit about the lines that we do. You know, we, you know, it goes right back to the Sir William Lyons days where all the lines on a Jaguar are all about making a car look like it's moving when it's standing still. And that is a real kind of art in itself. Okay, can I have a go? 
Oh, it feels but amazing, it, it though. It feels nice, doesn't it? And, you know, I think part of designing a Jaguar like the I-Pace is actually feeling those surfaces. And that line is, like, so strong on the car, isn't it? It's amazing, actually. Yeah, the, the, we, you know, we don't use many lines because we like design purity, but the lines that we use have to be very, very precise because if you have fewer lines, they do a more important job. That was brilliant. I love that. Should we go on to the next stage? Yeah, let's do Excellent. that. Thanks, Champ. What's unbelievable about this is it's shown the transition between a kind of clay relief to actually looking like a painted, finished car. But are you telling me that's clay? Yeah, it's all clay that's under clay. there. It's all clay under there. That looks like a real car at the front. Yeah, well, that's part of our job and part of the team's job is to make the models look as much like a real car as possible because that's the only way we're gonna properly analyze what they're gonna look like on the road. A big part of the team is to have the best people in every department and we have an amazing paint team as well that create all sorts of different colors for us for the future, but also paint our clay models so we can really analyze them and they're a big part of how we get to a final design. To start with, to analyze the surfaces, we always use silver because silver shows off the form the best. As you can see here, the transition yeah. with how the light is falling on here and the shadow under this crisp line here. And that is a big part of car design. It's playing around with light and shadow and highlights and reflections and just creating something that is very highly desirable. Now we go from this to the finished car. Can we have a look? Absolutely, let's do it. The finished car in all of its glory. Is it real? It's not a clear model. It is real, George, it is real. Yeah, we're very, very proud of it. It won three World Car Awards at the same events. First time any car has ever done that. It's a revolution, this car, isn't it? I mean, that's not an overstatement. It is an absolute revolution in terms of car design and green technology. Yeah, I think it is. I think it is because, you know, we, we totally use the EV technology, the batteries, the electric drivetrains to really have this clean sheet of paper design and free up all that interior space. Obviously with the 21 model year, we've been able to enhance the car even further. So we've got beautiful detailing that we've worked on. Um, and I'm assuming just the kind of feeling of being in the car is something really important to you as a designer. It's all about, you will definitely feel better when you've had a journey in the Jaguar because it is just such a fantastic place to be. It gives a real feel-good factor. It's a real sense of well-being. You're surrounded by beautiful, luxurious materials and high-end design and technology. It's a combination of a dramatic exterior that creates that desire and then that just lovely, tranquil feeling when you're in a car like, like the I-Pace. So you realise that you're driving a fantastic piece of green technology, aren't you? Exactly, you know, it is really guilt-free sporting luxury because, you know, zero emissions. Well, congratulations, not just on a stunning car, which I love, I adore this car, but on a fantastic building as well. 